Need to change the color of your artboard in Illustrator? Let's find out how in this tutorial. Once you have your documents ready and your artboards laid out, you want to go to File, Document Setup. In your Document Setup panel, be sure to click Simulate Colored Paper. And then to change to the color you want, click this. You'll have a range of options to choose from. You can choose from the color wheel. You can set specific sliders with specific values. And you can also choose from a range of presets. You can also use the eyedropper tool here to select the color that you desire. And once you're happy with it, then simply check the X and the color changes. Once you press OK, you'll notice that nothing happens. Don't worry, this is just a little bit of a glitch in the software. If you then come to your artboard tool here and press it, it will then update the artboards for you accordingly. Now, this is great if you want to change the color of multiple artboards, but if you want to do it for a specific artboard, there's another way you can do this as well. If I just revert this back to white, come over to my layers panel. You see I've got layer one here. What I can do, if I turn off my stroke, use my rectangle tool and I draw out a rectangle the size of my canvas, click the selection tool, and then either using the swatches panel or the color fill here, I can select the color that I desire for my background, press OK. And then finally, if I come to my layer, I can double click it, rename it background or keep it as layer one, lock that layer by pressing here and then over the top of this then I can just create a new layer and draw over the top of it. So there you have it. If you want to change the color of your artboards in Illustrator, there's two very effective ways to do this with minimal effort. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you liked it, please subscribe, turn on notifications, like the video and let me know of any problems you have in Illustrator or any other Adobe software that you'd like me to do tutorials for in the future. And I'll see you next time for the next tutorial.